Hey YouTube, Dawson Ryder here with my review of the deluxe Do Re 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 Do Re Mi Fa Beat Gasha. That's going to be a thing for me to say. But this is uh, Common Rider Brave's level two Gasha, which is based on a rhythm video game. So yay, let's get started. Anyway. So as we usually do, just a quick look at the box. Same clothes style we've been getting, a picture of the Gasha there, picture of level 3 Brave there. On the top shows you how it works in the driver, there's the name on the side, and on the back it shows you yet again how it works, advertises the rest of the line in general. Pretty much your standard fare. Now, let's take an actual look at the uh, Gasha, which I feel like this one in particular leans towards my whole these look like popsicles because it looks like it's going to be lime flavored or something or lemon lime flavored but yeah pretty much what you've come to expect from gashats as i always mentioned i do like them even though they kind of look like um they're going to be lollipops but the, the cartridge aspect is there uh, you got the neat little art here on the front which is like a little cartridge video game cover with this little dj guy dj blunts no it's not um, and then over here you can sort of see the designs that are going to be coming through uh, when it's illuminated via the the driver Okay, so now for the sounds when it's just on its own. There's the uh, victory noise. And then the standard noise. And then the losing noise. Alright, now we'll put it in the driver, and I think I'll do it on its own first, because I think I forgot to do that with Geki Tatsu Robots, or whatever the hell it's called. Um, but yeah, so we'll do that first, and then after I do the driver stuff, I'll, I'll push the buttons to get the attack sounds, since I don't have uh, the intelligence to put this in the right way, uh, the uh, attack slot. Alright. So you can see the little design in there that I was talking about, you know, uh, that illuminates, which is neat. It's like a little DJ guy. Surrounding stage ready for the rider. And it'll just go there for a few seconds. Alright. So now... We will do it combined with Bokinja, with Tattle Quest. So, wait. Let's do it. Alright, so you can see one of my favorite parts about it is the, the dual layering of it, so it's kind of creating a background for it. Okay, so now for the attack sounds. Okay, so I'll press both of these. Like a one. Whoops. Okay, press both of these. Critical strike. Whoops. Alright, now for critical finish. Alright, and that's pretty much about the end for that. Uh, so, just like always, my, my pretty much traditional recommendation spiel at the end of gimmicks is they're all the same quality, um, and I do like the Gashats, so it's up to you whether you want all or some of them, um, or what noises you particularly like. I actually quite like this one in particular, I really like the beat noises in it, but if you're into the Gashats, it's the same fun that any other Gashat would be for you. But anyway, that's about it. Until next time, make sure you have the crazy podcast at writersrangerdevils.com, and of course, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Till next time, Dawson Ryder, signing out.